Outlander, 2008, directed by Howard McCain, offers a unique genre fusion that combines Viking mythology with science fiction, starring Jim Caviezel as Kanon, a soldier from another world, and Sophia Miles, John Hurt, and Ron Perlman. Outlander is a bold and inventive story that imagines an extraterrestrial crash landing in Norway during the Viking era, with a terrifying creature, the Morwen, following close behind. The film explores a clash of worlds that brings Viking warriors face to face with advanced alien technology and a monstrous predator, all set against a richly atmospheric Scandinavian landscape. Outlander creates an intriguing Viking setting, blending traditional elements with a futuristic twist. The film crafts authentic Viking villages, showcasing wooden fortresses, dense forests, and brutal battle rituals that immerse viewers in the period. The addition of alien technology, like Kainan's high-tech weaponry and interstellar lore, is surprisingly cohesive, creating a believable narrative of two vastly different worlds colliding. While some historical purists may find it a stretch, the film does an admirable job of portraying Viking culture, its hierarchies, warrior code, and mythology, while introducing extraterrestrial elements that elevate the film's tension and originality. Jim Cavassell delivers a stoic yet emotionally layered performance as Kainian, a man haunted by his past and guilt, who must adapt to Viking ways and gain their trust to survive. His portrayal balances both strength and vulnerability, and he does well in conveying his character's sense of isolation and duty. Sophia Miles as Freya, the chieftain's daughter, offers a fierce performance that brings some grounding humanity to the story, while John Hurt as King Hrothgar brings gravitas and a sense of authority, adding depth to the Viking leadership. Ron Perlman's cameo as the ruthless Gunnar is brief but impactful, as his warrior presence and imposing demeanor bring additional tension to Kainan's mission. The cast collectively provides strong performances, making the character dynamics feel genuine, despite the fantastical setting. Thematically, Outlander delves into ideas of redemption, survival, and the merging of cultures. Kanan's struggle with his past and Morwen's symbolic role as the monster he has unwittingly unleashed adds layers to his character and drives the film's exploration of guilt and penance. The clash of Viking warriors with alien technology raises questions about humanity's relationship with the unknown and the possibility of unlikely alliances when survival is at stake. The film suggests that heroism isn't tied to one world or culture, but is a universal trait, uniting people across vast differences. Though these themes might not be as deeply developed as in more philosophical sci-fi films, they add a meaningful layer to the action-driven story. The plot follows Kanan, an alien warrior who crash lands on Earth in the time of the Vikings, only to discover that he has unwittingly brought with him a dangerous creature known as the Morwen. As he is taken captive by the Viking villagers, he must earn their trust and eventually join forces with them to hunt down the monstrous threat. The storyline blends high-stakes survival with elements of Viking epic, and Morwen's rampage provides plenty of tension and suspense. Though the narrative is fairly straightforward, it's engaging and well-paced, maintaining a good balance between action sequences and character development. For today's audiences, Outlander may be viewed as a hidden gem that combines the best elements of action, historical drama, and sci-fi thriller. Its ambitious genre blending, while potentially jarring to some, appeals to fans of unique storytelling who enjoy both Viking tales and futuristic themes. The film's practical effects, use of CGI, and creature design, while not groundbreaking by today's standards, are well executed and add to the film's intensity. However, the blend of genres may limit its appeal to a niche audience, as it doesn't fully embrace either genre. The historical aspects might appeal to Viking enthusiasts, while sci-fi fans may enjoy the imaginative alien lore, but Outlander remains a bold experiment that appeals most to fans of genre-crossing films. In conclusion, Outlander, 2008, is a refreshing mix of Viking action and sci-fi thriller providing a unique narrative that pushes the boundaries of historical fantasy. Its portrayal of the Viking era is atmospheric and immersive, 
And while the plot may be straightforward, the film's ambition and character-driven narrative make it memorable. For today's viewers, Outlander is an unusual, entertaining film that combines mythology with extraterrestrial suspense, delivering an inventive take on the Stranger in a Strange Land storyline that's worth a watch for fans of cross-gen 